After the truck is weighed and the testing concluded, processing begins. The cargo is transferred to conveyor belts that carry the cane to the crushing system. Cane that was cut manually is first washed to remove impurities. The water is treated and reutilized. The cane is then chopped up and readied for crushing. Sugarcane harvested by machines is cut into small pieces by the harvester and skips this phase. After the crush, either by rollers or a diffusion system, what's left of the cane stalk is known as bagasse, a fibrous residue that is burned in boilers to generate bioelectricity. The cane juice is used to produce sugar and ethanol. The projected cane crush for the 2010-2011 harvest in South Central Brazil is expected to reach 595 million tons.